everybody. Welcome back. It is your pal Al, and we are playing Stray. I think this is going to be video 10 in the series, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and we are just now starting a chapter called The Control Room. Um, for those of you that just came from the last video, uh, B12, Kitty, and Clementine just uh, escaped from jail in a harrowing escape where they escaped from the Sentinels. And then uh, we got this subway working and we showed up at a place called the Control Room. Helper 477, hello. How may I help you? Uh, well, he doesn't look aggressive. That's good. Oh, look, all the stuff actually is clean up here. Everything actually has. I'm just seeing if there's like, huh. All right, well, let's get out of here. Wow. Walled City 99. Walled City 99. <coughs> Greetings, inhabitants of Walled City 99. So, is there just a whole bunch of walled cities around the world? And with and they're all robots? And, like, each one of them has, like, its own sections, and the robots are programmed to just, like, stay down there and do their purpose? You got, you got robots in the slums, the sewers, of every aspect. I'm currently painting this area. Please be careful about paint. Have a nice day. Wow. Walled City 99. Does that mean there's 98 other walled cities? This is kind of nuts. City sealed. Enjoy the world's safest city. Walled City 99. Violation of the rules of confinement will result in heavy prison sentence. What is this? Greetings, inhabitants of Walled City 99. The door leading to the service is currently locked due to the confinement procedure. Please refer to any certified engineer inside the control room if you have any requests. Have a nice day. What? Is it ever open? Oh, wait. Look. Oh, wait. No, no. What's this? That's where we came from before. Look at that. So, okay. All the way down there at the bottom. That's the slums. That's where we first started out, remember? In like our first first couple of episodes. And then remember, you can still see it all the way over there. See the tower we went to? And the crane that we walked across? And all the, the zerks down there? And then look, that's Midtown. You can literally see the elevator we took up to Midtown. And uh, the area where we stole the battery. Yeah, that's Midtown right there. And then we took uh, the subway from there to here. So we're now like on the third level. You have the slums, the Midtown, and now we're in an area called the Control Room. This is so wild. Look, and we're still underground though. It's still this big walled city. Wow. But look, there's all this stuff, but there's like nobody here. There's like no one here to enjoy it. Why not like take all the, the people from the slums and all the other robots and bring them up here and let them enjoy it. Yeah, why not let everybody out? Because there's so much nice, clean stuff up here. And it's obviously been just getting clean non-stop forever. Because, well, they've just been sitting here cleaning, it seems like, for ages. not letting me interact with it. It says triangle and I'm hitting triangle. I must need something. Well, yeah, I understand that, but we need something to open that. Only humans are authorized to enter. It says that I'm not considered human. 
Hey, that's offensive security proof. Yeah, cause Kitty's, you know, not human either, but Kitty's got like a pulse and she's, you know, warm and like it's not she's not a robot, right? So between the two of them. Ah, uh, here we go. Come on. Follow me. Thank you. What? things or something. I mean, I can reach it just fine. Okay. I know I have to do something. With this. Well, but I hop up here and it's not doing anything. And I can't can I get this thing to move? No. Well, B12, here, you do something with it. Right. I'm trying to. Okay, hold on. There we go. <laughs> and I didn't get electrocuted, which is nice. Wow, what is this? It's probably been sealed off for years. I wonder if all the humans are dead. I remember hating them so much, they had everything. Clean space, limitless power, freedom to move. Little good it did them. Yeah, I feel like all the humans died. The plague, I remember now. Everyone was dying and they thought they were above it all. They did nothing to help us. I watched my family die. I felt helpless. I couldn't do anything to save them. Aww. But I can still help you. We can still go outside together. I will carry the memories of humanity and the people I loved. So, they built these walled cities, these big underground walled cities, uh, when the world started to, like, come to an end due to a plague, and, uh, they have all these robots in there that were there to, like, clean for them and work for them and security and all this stuff, right? And it sounds like all the humans died, and this is what's left is these big empty cities with just no humans and just robots. So the robots need to be let free to, like, and, and the artificial intelligence over time, it seems like, has gotten better and better and evolved and they started to like mimic humans and you know but I mean they need to let the robots from the slums and stuff up here to enjoy the place I mean if they want to why wouldn't you yeah look at that look at that look how cool that is oh my gosh and then it's beautiful too the graphics so Midtown is right there. It's about halfway. And then the slums is all the way in the bottom. So these big cities like this are tiered where the people all the way up, like this is the control room, probably the really, you know, rich, 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 rich people. The middle right down there would be your middle class. And then the ones in the very bottom is, you know, the blue collar, you know, slums, yada, yada. Wow. Wow, 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 yeah. It looks like once upon a time. Once upon a time. This would have been filled up with humans, but they all died, so now robots are just, they have robot cities. <laughs> 
That's the main computer. According to the mainframe, no one has been here for years. The whole city is stuck in a lockdown cycle from long ago. If we disable it, we should be able to leave. I wonder if the outside world is, like, okay or good or happy. These computers hold the data we need. We need to tr turn them on. While you do that, I'll look for passwords and encrypt, uh, encrypted keys to get into the system. Doing what I'm supposed to do. Come on, there we go. Come on, pity pats. There we go. Oh, my bad. Mm. All of them are on. Good work. Good job, my friend. Oh man, this is craziness. I hope all the robots down below and everything get to enjoy it too. There, that's the workstation to open the city. There are several layers of security preventing us from using it. We need to do what we do best. Um, me, I'll hack the machines and you destroy some stuff. <laughs> Alright. What do you want me to, to destroy? Here we go. <laughs> pity pat, pity pat, pity pat. I jump up there. Yeah. Go. Nice. Hack it. Whoa. Right. The, 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 the system is taking more than I expected. Hopefully he's okay at the end of all this. Of course. charge once we end up at the word stake it's workstation I have this feeling that like he's not gonna be able to recharge you know what I mean I have this like bad feeling that like I don't know oh I'm worried b12 is gonna get hurt Yeah, B12's totally gonna get fried. I don't want that. No! B12. I th th think this little body is done for me. It's okay, I'll be right. Just carry me to the workstation, we can disable that alarm. Yeah, we need a new body for you, buddy. Which, which workstation? This one? Is it this one? Yeah, right here.
Sorry, we won't see the outside together. Dude, no. This is extremely sad. This is such a good game so far, but don't be sad. Doors opening, but it, I mean that's awesome that the doors opening, but um, I wish B12 was. Open. Oh yeah, they don't like light because they're bacteria. I forgot about that. opening up and it'll just be a big city. Wow. There's nothing I can do for B12 though. Like just gotta leave him. is awesome but I'm so sad about B12 you know oh I wish B12 didn't have to die yeah the world seems fine outside look at all the wildlife and the sun so the humans all died but you know who knows what's out there 
gonna meet up with your kitty friends again? Is that it? Oh my gosh, that's it? Oh my goodness, what the heck? Oh, so... Mm. Oh man, okay, initial thoughts, awesome game. Very different from what I normally play. It was beautiful, it was well thought out there it was a very good platforming puzzle game there was some action but not like too much um they did a good job of constantly keeping everything new and mixing it up and uh, i just i didn't expect it to get me in the feels like that i didn't expect it to like tug at my heartstrings um i heard some zapping at the end there that made us think that maybe b12 isn't dead but I, uh, a lot going on in that game. A lot going on in that game. Um, super cool game. Highly recommend it. Hey, thank you to everybody who joined me on this ride. Again, it is your pal Al. I love you guys, and I will catch you in the next game.